Hi, this is Tim. And this is Amber. And a user of our IP Explorer Pro sent in this footage setting and reading the IP address of a 1756 EMBT, and we are excited to share it with you. Once you have set the SIM IPE's IP address and the target address of the device that is looking for a boot P or DHCP request, you simply go to Assign IP Address, then use Boot P DHCP and wait for it to say Accepted. After the IP address is assigned, you will see an option at the bottom saying OK, Set Static. Simply pressing the OK button will set the 1756 EMBT's IP address to static, disabling Boot P, which will make it retain this IP address during a power cycle. You can also set an EMBT static IP address back to dynamic, change it to another address, then set it back to static, allowing you to change the IP address of a 1756 EMBT without using RS Logics, Studio 5000, or RS Links. This is a great feature for a technician that needs to change an EMBT but isn't trained to program PLCs. Along with setting an IP address, the SIM IPE can also read an IP address. You simply go to read unknown IP, then plug it directly into your device. Do you have a great application story you would like to share? Send us your footage and if we use it, then we might have a little something for you. Till next time. See ya. This is the exciting part. <laughs> Hi, this is Tim. And this is Amber of TW Controls. We run the automation store. Be sure to subscribe for more great videos. And like this video and comment on what you would like to see next. Visit our website where we offer a full line of PLCs, simulators, control panels, PLC trainers, and more.